Okay, so I'm here with Ron Haslam, absolute legend when it comes to, to motorbikes. Ron, for, for those people watching now who perhaps don't know your illustrious history, perhaps you could tell them a little bit about what you've done over your career. Yeah, uh, obvious bikes have been my whole career. Uh, I've started at the club level in England, uh, progressed right through to the GPs. Um, I'm a three times world champion, uh, Formula One twice, Formula Three once. Um, Isle of Man, places like that, you know, the really hard circuits. Uh, Macau, I've won Macau six times. Um, you know, quite a bit, you know, really uh, I finished fourth in the you know, MotoGP stuff, you know, which is like, you know, a big bonus for me. Yeah, so yeah, good. So you've had a, a fantastic career on bikes, now <laughs> teaching people, idiots like myself, how to ride them. Um, yeah. We're here with two absolute icons. Yeah. I mean, this is the original 1990 Fireblade. I mean, perhaps we could have a little look at it and you can explain what made this bike so special when it, when it well, came out. Yeah, the, the bike itself was, you know, for the time, you know, 1990, uh, I had these at the race school and uh, they were just so far ahead of the opposition in every way, you know, um, stable, um, fast in engine wise, and the biggest one of all, reliable. You know, you could just run them forever and they, you just never got a problem with them. I, I rode this one out on the road earlier and, yeah. um, you know, I, I'm a big fan of, of the latest bikes, but th what amazed me is it, how good it is still now to this day. It is, you know, the, the appearance might not look as uh, sleek as the new modern day no. ones, but uh, the performance and all that is still there, you know. Um, as I say, they have improved uh, in lots of areas, but uh, it's still a good bike. So what made you pick this bike for your race school back then? Again, uh, I've got a good association with Honda, and as I say, the biggest one for a race school, you want something that's you know, powerful, uh, up for the younger generation that they like, which this one, this one was, and uh, reliable, you know, just reliable. You just don't, you know, maintenance was like non-existent. It was, you'd just run and run and run with them. Um, and the performance was uh, really second to none at that time. And uh, tell me a little bit about the engine. I mean, what sort of, what sort of power <coughs> does something like this put out? At the time now, um, you'd be on 100, 150 brake horse, you know, 100, you know, 140, 150 brake horse on, on this type of, type of bike, which for the time, again, it was very good, mm. you know. Um, I don't know exactly the brake horse power, but I think it's more the, the control of the power. It was so smooth. It had got no uh, problems in the power. It wasn't power bandish, that, you know, hard to ride. Uh, it was so easy to ride. So I think it was the overall power uh, was pretty strong, but I think more so easy to ride, you know, uh, easy you, to go fast on. I mean, it's 25 years since, since this arrived. Mm. I mean, what do you think made, made the Fireblade name such an icon? I mean, what is it that people love so much? I think just, you know, the Honda name, and the Honda name is, is really, um, as soon as you say Honda, you go reliability, strong, and uh, up to date good all-around fast bike, you know, with, with no problems in it. So have you got uh, much of a collection? Have you got one of these in the in I haven't, the to be honest, no. As I say, I had them at the school uh, when, when they first come out, which was, you know, fantastic for me. Um, but no, I haven't got one in the collection. Yet. But you have got quite a few of these. So how, how many of the, uh, the new model have you got in, in your current the, race school? The new model now, um, I think we've got the most, most of anybody, of all the dealers and everything now. You know, we're probably up about 15 to 20 in total. Um, New Fireblade, as you can see, from new to old, uh, you know, massive difference as far as uh, performance is concerned. You know, we're up to like 180, 190 brake horse now. I think the biggest thing that's happened uh, from, from then to now is electronics. The electronics is so nice on it, yeah. you know. I rode these two back to back on, on the road today and what, what really struck me by this is how quickly it picks up. I mean, that, that power is absolutely instant and how fast it is to, to, on, in terms of handling. It just changes direction so quickly. Uh, yeah, as I say, the, the new one, it, it's, they've gone a really a big town on the lightness. So the bike is so light now compared to anything, uh, even the bikes I used to ride in GPs, full blown uh, GP bikes, it's as light as one of them now. Yeah. You've been out um, giving people some, uh, some rides on the back of this today. Unfortunately, I didn't, I didn't, I didn't get a go, but mm. what do those people say uh, when they got off the back of it? I mean, what sort of feedback were you getting? The biggest thing I get, you know, from me and at my school when I do the pillions is they can't believe that this is a road bike, yet you can make it go so fast. They just think that you've changed it. You know, they don't think it can be a road bike because it's, it performs as like a GP bike, you know. And uh, when they go on the back and they can see that, you know, it just... Uh, I don't know, it just gives them such a, it opens the eyes to what this bike can do in, in the, 
trim that it's in, standard trim, out of the box, and it is so, so powerful, so strong, it does, does everything you want. So we've had 25 glorious years of, of, of Fireblade history. I mean, what would you like to see um, from, in the future from, from Honda when it comes to the Fireblade name? It's from Honda itself. I think, to be fair, the Honda is always one that um, makes sure that the bike's solid before it comes out. Um, so really, you know, what they're bringing out at the moment is, is you know, yeah, I'm sort of happy with it. It's, uh, it does everything I want, you know. Um, so if this, was a, if, if this was a pinnacle, you'd be happy with it? Definite, you know, definite. It's just like, if you could have someone in my time, this performance-wise, you, you, you're just on a winner. You'd so, big question, if I was letting you take the keys to uh, one of these, which one would you be taking home tonight? I'm not the old-fashioned one, I like the new stuff, you know, I'd always go for this one. You know, this one's like, yeah, it's me, you know, it's, uh, I like all the new modern stuff. Fantastic. Yeah. Well, Ron, thank you very much for your time today, it's been a pleasure thank to Thank you very you. much. Thank you. Cheers.